Journal Files. So today I'm coming to you guys with a highly requested video. This is going to be a video of a comparison of the diapers. I have Huggies, I have Loves, I have um, Up and Up, and I also have the Honest Company. Now, I have tried Pampers, but I don't actually have an extra Pampers to show you in this video, but I have used Pampers before. But I'm gonna go ahead and get into um, this video about the comparison between all of the different diapers. I've tried them all, so maybe this video will help the next person. Who knows? Okay, so first, um, I want to talk about the Pampers diapers. The Pampers diapers were okay. They weren't my cup of tea, per se. Now, in the hospital, or at least the hospital that I delivered at, they give you pampered diapers um, for your newborn baby. And they come in like a pack of 20 or something like that. But I didn't really like those diapers because they didn't really hold very much. They're like the little snugglers by Huggies where they have like the line that shows you um, when the baby is wet. I didn't too much care for that when it came to the Pampers. They were just so darn flimsy. I just... I didn't like Pampers. Now there are other people that live by Pampers, but I'm one of those people that's just like, eh, I'd rather have a Huggies. So let's talk about the Huggies. This is, hopefully you guys can see that, but this is one of the Snug and Dries. The little snugglers are like these, but they have like the little line here for um, the wetness indicator. But I actually love Huggies. One of the reasons is because of the elastiband in the back. There's also an elastiband on the sides. And if you notice, this thing is lined pretty darn well. It's thick to some people, but to me, it's actually pretty awesome. Um, I've heard different people say, you know, Pampers are better than Huggies because they're wider, just in case, you know, your baby has a big butt or whatever. My baby has a big butt and his little, his butt fits in these things just fine. So I have no problems with Huggies whatsoever. He does not pee through them at all. The Pampers, he peed through, but I mean, I actually love Huggies personally. So teach their own. So next I want to talk about the honest company um everybody has been ranting and raving about the honest company they are supposed to be um one of the companies that's like for hypoallergenic and you know also it's supposed to be like clean and healthy for the environment and all that stuff i have tried the honest diapers i like the honest diapers but they're too expensive for me for my taste per se with Huggies and with Pampers, you can find coupons for like a dollar off. If you coupon, then you know what I mean about finding Huggies and Pampers for next to nothing. But um, as far as the Honest Company, they don't really do sales, but their diapers are pretty darn nice. Um, on the back, they have the Elastiband, just like the Huggies does. It's not as flexible as the Huggies, but they do have the Elastiband. They also have the Elastiband here on the sides. And then the inside of it is lined pretty well. Um, it's actually lined from front to back, from the bum to the front. It's actually a complete lining, which I actually do like. Um, and it's a thick one, just like the Huggies are. Um, he has yet to pee through an Honest Company diaper, but like I said, they're a little too rich for my blood. But I mean, if you can afford it, then by all means go for it. Um, Judy swears by these. I don't know if you guys watch her, um, It's Judy's Life, um, but she uses these diapers and no other diapers, I don't think so. But um, I've used them before, I actually like them. Will I purchase them again? Possibly, I might order some more of these maybe but I've had you know better results with other diapers that are actually cheaper so hmm. next on the list are loves I actually got um, some loves diapers as a diaper cake um, 
one of my girlfriends had made a diaper cake with the Love's diapers and she made another one with the Huggies diapers. That's how I ended up with both of those so that I could try them out. Um, I like the Love's because you can find these super cheap. I think you can get a pack of like 108 for like $18 at Walmart and then most of the um, most of the time you can find like a dollar off coupon. Um, if you guys are military spouses, then you know that you can get a box of like a hundred at the commissary and they normally run about 12, 13 bucks. It's tax free and also you can use your coupon there. So, I mean, you can rack up on these too. Um, the back of them does not have the elastiband, but the sides, they do have the elastiband and this one is actually lined from bum to front and these are um supposed to be like overnight or something like that and he has yet to peek through one of these i love these things um i would recommend these to anybody that's on a budget when it comes to babies and you need some diapers that are gonna work and it's gonna hold it this one holds it last on the list is going to be the up and up brand if you guys don't know what up and up brand is up and up is the target brand these are the hypoallergenic ones they come in a yellow box um i believe it's 156 of them in here and i believe that box was like 16 or 17 dollars and they normally have coupons where you can double up on your coupons and you can get two dollars off instead of a dollar off so i ask i absolutely love these love 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 these like i've tried all the diapers that you can think of and out of all the diapers that i have reviewed this is the one that i would recommend to anybody it's hypoallergenic for one so in case your baby has allergies to diapers because the pampers and the loves have powder in their formula so if your baby is like allergic to the powder then you know your baby will have breakouts those two things right there would x out the pampers and the loves right there on the spot so that will only leave you with huggies um the honest company and up and up the honest company and up and up are known for having hypoallergenic diapers the huggies they are ones that do not have the powder in them but they're a little bit more on the expensive side because like a box of diapers is like 25 dollars versus getting a box of the um up and up it's like half that price now the honest company is going to be about that same price it's like 70 something dollars for a membership with them for like a monthly supply or something like that but i absolutely love these i would recommend these to anybody that is having a baby has a baby thinking about having a baby rack up on these things because you can get these things for like super super cheap this is this is a honest company diaper a loves diaper and a huggies diaper all in one and i will tell you why the elastic band is on the back just like the huggies one okay it's on the side just like the huggies the loves and the honest company and it holds from front to rear see that and it's um it's double layered so you know the baby is not gonna pee through these like he has yet to pee through these things and my son pees a lot like when I say a lot I mean a lot a lot he will go to bed around six o'clock at night he wakes up every couple of hours to eat but I don't change him when he wakes up and like starts his day around eight o'clock that next morning that's when I change his diaper this is what this diaper looks like and I'm not playing with you this is one of the up and up brand diapers that is from last night and I want to show you that these things this thing is huge right now look at this thing on my hand okay this thing is freaking huge and my hand is pretty darn big this thing on my hand and you see how thick it is and it's it it has yet to leak so this is my um my video on the comparison of all of the different diapers that you see here 
um, plus the Pampers diaper because I don't have an a extra Pampers diaper. But this is all of the diapers that I have tried thus far. I hope this will help someone out there so that they don't waste a lot of money on trying different diapers on your child because it can be expensive. Um, I want to thank you all for um, watching this video. I hope you guys subscribe to my channel. Thumbs up this video if you haven't already. Make sure you leave your comments below in the comments box. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video. Y'all take care. Bye.